Hey guys, what's up? So today's gonna be a great day because finishing up the job um, and then it's supposed to be sunny and we're gonna go check out a bike today. And look, the zit has finally surfaced. It looks like crap, but it's finally surfaced. You remember, it was like three weeks ago when I got the zit underneath my skin and it's finally coming out. So like, I'm very happy about that. Oh, I'm gonna eat breakfast. Oh yeah, it's 7.06. So I, I stayed up till 12 last night, so I woke up at 6.30 um, to get myself six hours of sleep. And then I took a moment, like 15 minutes on my chair to watch videos to kind of wake up. It helps me wake up when I'm really tired. Um, so now I'm going to do my morning routine. I'm going to eat breakfast and do all that stuff. I used to do so much better. 202 pounds is what I weighed. Every day I go to the gym, but I stopped. As my body weight plummeted, so did my confidence. My lowest weight was a real wake up call. I started waking up Monday through Monday at 5 a.m. meal planning and going to the gym twice a day, every day. My mission, to show myself and you what success really takes. Okay, not starting off the day great. I, I, I got done eating and I've been procrastinating at 7.45. So like, I need to start my morning routine. I've been procrastinating. I'm gonna start it now. I'm gonna start right now and put my phone down. Okay, I'm vlogging mid-morning routine because I remember why I was procrastinating. I left my stuff in my car. Um, so I gotta get my book bag and everything. But I got done meditating, so that's good. And now I'm gonna do everything else. Quick update, it's like 10.30 and we're at the house um, that we're working on. So I will get back to you in a couple hours. See you then. Oh, and I did my morning routine. Got done with it at like 8.20. Ate and cleaned and packed and everything. So we're ready to go. I bet you guys thought I wasn't going to the gym today. Nope, I'm at the gym and today's gonna be chest day. It is like 8.33, um, so I'm gonna have the opportunity to work out really hard. It's not too late. My face is kinda like weird today, I don't know. Um, so, busy day, a lot of work. Um, and there was some sitting around not doing much, but, you know, like, it's vacation, whatever. So, I can't really work on anything if, unless I'm at home anyway at the apartment, so like, you know. Or that's why I'm going home four out of that's why I'm going home like three or four days every week um, to meal prep and stuff. Yeah, so let's hit this chest workout. Guys, I wanted to share this moment with you. So I'm eating 225 pounds, 245 plus on each side for incline bench. I'm doing six reps and I just wanted to say this moment is like really significant. Like I've done this before, um, but it's really significant because I remember the day, I remember the day about two years ago when I, on um, incline bench press, when I was able to do 145 on each side for six reps. I was barely able to do it and I had to have a slaughter. But it's just like, it's crazy because you go from that to, to being able to do like 30 reps of that on incline bench. And now I'm able to do, work out with, you know, 225 pounds on incline bench. It's like, it's crazy. And the crazy thing is, one day, It'll be the same thing, but I'll be reflecting on when I was at two plates, and then I'll be at three plates on incline bench press. It's crazy, and and the day I do that, I'll go back to this video and I'll show you guys. Maybe block 433. Who knows? It'll be in here somewhere. Progress is is, is crazy because you forget like how much you actually make when it's been this long. Real quick, I think I said six reps. I'm at four, four to five. Uh, my last set going down to 205 because I barely pushed out three last time. So I'm finishing up, then we'll move on to some dumbbell stuff. Whew, just got done hitting triceps. Really good pump, really good chest pump. You know, um, it's 9.39, so it's been a little over an hour and we are heading out. Um, I'm gonna weigh myself real quick on the scale that's not reliable. If it gives me a crap number, I'm gonna flick it off and then I'm not gonna worry about it. Oh my gosh, watch this. I kicked the scale accidentally, <laughs> just to the side. And look, so let's see. Oh, oh, oh. Nothing's this is a on nice scale. scale, man. This is a really nice scale. I'll take 323. Yeah. Let's see what it says for real. Oh, I'm too much, dude. I'm too much weight. Oh, crap, error, dude. <laughs> what the heck is it doing? I don't know, did you try this one? No, oh, this one's unreliable, too. Now this, this one's cracked. Look. No, it's cracked. Oh, you got on it one too many times. Yeah, it says I'm like 190. Dude. Yeah, did it say I was 160? Heck no. 
I'm taking 330. So I feel, I feel like I'm about, you know, 204. So I'm gonna say 203 and a half today. That's what I'm right down, 203 and a half.